Okay, I think we're live again. Uh, just in time. We just found a game as well. So, uh, we have the last here on hideout. Should be live again. Hopefully, people find their way back. They took down our stream. Rip. This stream dropped. We should be back again. They took down the previous one. <laughs> Had to go live again. It's bad, man. It just dropped. Uh, I was just told that my, my stream was taken down just because the, there's a chance that I was playing uh, copyrighted music. That's what I was told. That my video, live video is taken down because there's a chance that I'm playing someone else's music. That's essentially what it said. All right. Let's go make sure everything is in order. So there'll probably be a little bit of alt tabbing going on. Ah, oh, doubt luring. Oh, that's okay. I mean, the fact that you guys are watching me right now, I think we're we're fine. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, that's what these things do. That won't go back. I'm just not sure how this affects what it does to my if it does anything to my channel. Right. I'm trying to like see if there's anything anywhere. Where I have any information on that. Or if it just took down my stream, nothing happens, and I just have to start a new stream. The first time this happens to me. Why no Loom and House? Oh! I thought I queued up Loom. Ooh, my bad. I thought I did it, actually. But, I mean, I'm behind walls as well, so it's not the end of the world, but yeah, I should have definitely done Loom. It's not been a great opening. But there are circumstances, okay? Sylvia, <laughs> 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 
I think I might try fast guys with cow archers. Maybe Keshik. I don't know. Maybe just a warning, yeah, it could be. I mean, if I don't get pressured in Feudal Age, having no loom is still is a better opening, right? So, it might turn out for the better. And I have 50 extra gold to spend. Weapon copyright music played. I thought the music I was uh, I'm playing the stream beats, right? And they are supposedly copyright free. But maybe Facebook doesn't know that, or I, I mean I don't know even know how that works. Oh, who knows? I'm an hour seven, eight, two. I have no idea. To be honest, I never understood why having a machine that makes clothes double someone's HP and give them gives them armor. It's what it is. I think I'm just gonna try to be aggressive. I don't think it's necessarily the right or the best play. If I go like two range, have archers. Try to put some pressure, maybe add some TCs behind. We'll find out if it's good or not. And 11 on wood, I guess that's acceptable. Four on gold only though. It's probably not great. Few relics on our side. That's nice. Warcorn is insane in team game, but only one decent one one. Because you have teammates in team games to rely on to help you get to war wagons, for example. They're not insane in team games either. They're good in team games. I think they're solid in, in one one as well. Like Steam, I mean, AO2DE is obviously I can check on Steam, AO2DE. That doesn't add all the hours I've played in all the other AOE, two, AOE versions, right? So it's not really possible to uh, distinguish. There's a nice hill there and two gold piles for him. Not too many hills on higher that you can use for uh, the tatter bonus. There are a few. Nice win yesterday. Thank you, Gerardo. It's not a great monastery. I'm committed. I think he has made a stable in scouts. Don't uh, maybe it is the the same scout that was there earlier. I don't know actually.
Because I kind of want to make sure he cannot wall either. this guy to find his scout. Yeah, he definitely has a stable. Confirmed. Oh! Okay, that should be a snipe. I see all relics. I should be able to get all relics here, potentially. Maybe. I'm housed. Storm life. Yeah, I, th I should be able to get all relics. Methinks. Hmm. I can mine from taking stone, that would be fantastic. I think I go Balkan arrow now. Wait, where's my scout? Oh, did I lose my scout? I remember having a scout. He took that relic on the top. I'm probably quite far behind economically. I don't like our position that much, really. But yeah, okay. Yeah, they close the stream due to the music. issue I have right now is that he has an easy cast drop defense. It's probably 4 TC. I imagine. So I guess in late game I might have a decent palm. Do I have heavy camel? It's going to be skirms.
Full upgrade camo, but not the good in this cavalier. I guess fair enough, he's Sicilians. That makes sense. He's going skirms though. For now. No upgrades though. I feel like I'm getting too much done though. Right. Need to focus on my eco, I guess. I do prefer trying to be a bit aggressive. He decides to move out and drop a bit of a forward castle, maybe we can jump with knights and such. How's Kashyyyk fair against Cavalier? Uh, Kashyyyk should be pretty good. No matter what here. I need ballistics badly. When did that guy got sniped? The culprit. We have five relics. Tower's late game should be pretty solid. Probably an okay spot. Yeah, I think Keshe Kawa should, if I can get that composition rolling, that should be really sweet. Might end up not getting one of my relics. Sag. Oh, Kevin. So I'll probably get it. Nice. There's no research on the top, it looks like. I think if I just stonewall that... Actually, maybe we can check this. Maybe there's something there. Bloodlines? I know, I was waiting for resources. There's a lot of things I'm still missing. But I think... Looks like we're gonna get to Imperial Age. What? In a somewhat okay position. It's gonna be a bit annoying. This is where I should have had Loom. 
Okay, there is no resource on the top. So if I just wall that part off, we're kind of okay. At least we got the relic. Kashik should be pretty good then. I'm going all out on this position though. If I don't hold that position, oh boy, oh boy. And we're in a pickle. Tanky. Six pierce. Oh, that's actually ugly. Ugly, ugly, ugly. <laughs> Need to get that up. Like my walls on the top. Because if I'm open and vulnerable to being raided there non stop, then that's really rough. And those cavaliers don't die to arrow fire. No. This, I mean, it's three castles, right? I, guess, I know he has arrow, like his good pierce armor, but come on. No chance he can justify this, right? This cavalier, man. I feel insane. chance that I just took too many losses here already. Like too much idle time in my eco, rather. Still missing some serious upgrades on my units. Yeah, I don't think I can hold this anymore. And that's my position that I was all out on. I think the biggest problem here was simply that we didn't wall the top side. Those raids just... For me, this game had to be like I fight in one spot type of game. When it became the type of game we have now, where we're fighting on multiple spots, it benefits the guy that doesn't have the range units. Because uh, I cannot... Those... 
He got those raids on my eco. And now I think I cannot... Um, I didn't get the upgrades I needed and everything, all that stuff to hold. I do have lead cash check, but yeah, I, I don't think I can hold this anymore. So tanky. We should wall some this No, it's not just that. Oh, he was taking death, not the one. Okay. Um, it was an obvious decision that I should have walled the top side earlier, because him going cavalier was also, I would say, fairly obvious. So I think, yeah, it just would have made so much sense in every way for me to to do that. Now I think I'm losing too much of my position. I still have a solid composition and five relics, so if I can stabilize, maybe. Where did those Cavalier go? They only have two castles. Just make sure I deny that one. I really need that stone up here as well. Getting helps. Oh, Cass is already down. call it not yet I, mean, I still have five relics i have a healthy population we have the top side walled now so it's not 100 over also i spent he has spent a lot of gold on his composition there i'm down to one castle now which isn't great I mean, I think we are dead, don't get me wrong. But I'm in a position where I should still play on. Put it that way. I try to get heavy cav. Uh, heavy cav watches, doesn't hurt. It's, it's more beneficial for him right now to open the path between us. Bad matchup? I don't think so. I think I, think I was in a good spot. I just... Uh, that's the issue now. Mm, I think I will have a hard time playing on both sides. I lost my market. Why do I s still send villagers down there? Must be the gather point. Market! Oh, my trap. I want to do my own. 
thing up there. This population is still healthy. Don't have wood. We're back to two castles as well now. We can probably get three. else that he's out of gold probably fairly low maybe I should try and open this and raid him it would actually benefit me okay, so this is his play now That was a very good fight for us. I guess it's time to get some upgrades. That's fine. Come here, trebuchets. It is elite sergeants. It's already up. Shit. I don't even have the last armor up right there. That's nasty. We won that engagement. One engagement at a time. to cut through a shared time no 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 i don't want to open more angles to fight i think my best situation right now is to fight in one spot he's preparing another attack on the top though i think he's out of gold like he's out of gold so he doesn't have a techno like uh, tech anymore right his tech right now is halberdier skirm light cap that's why sicilians are maybe good in the opening but they do suffer as the game goes on the composition right keep in mind i have five relics as well so uh yeah i would have been able to get a third castle up as well we would have three castles producing keshik at least So I, th I guess it's fair for him to resign here. He, he doesn't have anything else going for him, I believe. But I thought he would play longer, though. Actually, I had an eco except the food. 
timeline though. How was we looking? We were probably 10, 15, 20 villages behind, maybe mid castle age. We got five relics, so I think it's more, it was definitely worth it. Out of gold definitely helped and came in when it was needed the most. Any more cavalier would have hurt. Can you explain why he GG'd? It seems like he has options like cutting through the middle, half spam, etc. Um, he doesn't have a tech, uh, he doesn't have a composition anymore that can beat my composition. Right. What options does he have without gold? He has halberdiers, light cav, and skirmishers. That is not a, it's not a winning composition in any scenario. I guess the only thing he can try is like siege ram halberdier play, but that should not work against a guy that has five relics. Without his molding a bit in the first game, that sounds lovely. We got almost 5k relic gold in the end. Uh, definitely a risky approach by us though with the couch opening, but I feel like getting the relics was definitely a favorable thing. I did think we lost though when he cleaned this position. And also, if this was just walled early imp or in mid castleage, I would never struggle with the, his raids, and that would have had so much positive impact on my economy. This became such such a mess for my eco when uh, those just like those few cavaliers got in on the top. I also think if he gets this castle up, he might win the game. Because then there's no way for me to deny him entrance on the top side either. Uh, Donald, thanks for 100 stars. Uh, as a relative beginner, I think working to the ideal comp is something I need to focus on more. Yeah, that's what you always have to think about in late game scenarios, right? You Composition is what wins in the late game. If you think you have a worse composition late game, you might want to try to make more things happen in the early game. 